Hello wild people, we're back with Planet Zoo and we're continuing the Mars Zoo today. So it's one big franchise that we're sort of developing here, but I have some very exciting news. I have just bought, because they're on deal, all of the expansion packs, all of them. So we're going to see some brand new species for this Mars Zoo, which actually works great because last episode there was a random new species that I didn't even know about. So we're popping over to Europe, we're going to go to Mars Zoo, as you can see it's sort of a chocolate theme. And I made this little logo for the Mars Zoo and everything, I was very chuffed with it. But yeah, guys, I'm super excited about this. So, oh, that's a lima butt. How has this happened? I don't want to see a lima butt. So there's all lemurs and stuff in there. And oh, Planet Zoo, my favourite thing about Planet Zoo is definitely, definitely the franchise stuff because... It's kind of like sandbox mode and things, but I like challenges. I get a bit bored otherwise. Does anybody else feel that? Or is it just me? It might just be me. Um, so I think let's do, let's have um, another enclosure down here. I think let's let's make another enclosure here. Um, we have we have money, which surprises me. Um, <laughs> I'm very surprised. But look at the animal guys. I got to show you this animal trading. <laughs> Okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. Why is it all monkeys? Okay, let's have a look. And lemurs, Lone Ranger. I'm just gonna find something that is new. I'm gonna keep going through stuff until I find something new. Where is something new? This is a nightmare. I have everything. I literally have so much new. Look, I have an alpine ibex. I have an American alligator. I have one of these things I cannot pronounce. I have a prairie dog. I have sea lions. I have sea lions. Capybaras. Oh, I just don't know what to do with myself. So I think, I think, because I wanted to do the Toto Africa sandbox series, um, which I think we still might do, but then we'll do biomes, because now I actually have all of the expansion packs that are currently out. So I'm really excited. Oh, we bred a habitat species. That's nice. So, um, okay. I just need to check, actually, who that was, because I need to keep on top of it, because the lemurs are going to breed so well that I won't be able to keep on top of them. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's try and plan this a little bit. <laughs> you guys know I'm so good at planning stuff. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna like bring this down here, I think. We need like another staff, staffy zone -y thing. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring, I'm gonna like deselect grid. I'm gonna bring a staff, a staff path here, I think. Oh, not like that. That's awful. Um, yeah, I'm going to do this. Oh, I'm so excited. But we are going to save the conservation pack for my Lady Ranger Gamer channel, which is all horse themed because it's got horses on it. That's why. Right. Stuff facilities. We probably only need... Yeah, let's get a keeper's hut. We'll just get a little one in there. Will you fit? Oh, you will fit. Great. Let's get a keeper's hut and then we'll get a couple of staff rooms. If I can get the staff room to like fit. Oh, it will fit. That's nice. Just want to keep like, yeah, try and keep as much room as possible. So we'll just like, yeah, that's good. I wonder if the path though will kind of, yeah. Good, 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 good. Ah, that couldn't have gone better. Okay, oh my goodness. Like we've had more babies. Oh my goodness. Many guests think tickets are underpriced. You think, you wait, you wait world. We are, uh, I'm gonna make that eight and I'm gonna make that five. This is going to get good. We could start with uh, marketing, but I don't think we have quite the funds for marketing yet. Okay, so what animal are we going to put in next? We need something cool. Let's see what is on the highest appeal. <gasps> a polar bear. <laughs> we can have polar bears. We can afford them as well. This is, this is amazing. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, facilities without power. Of course it is. Right, okay. Let's still get more power. This is the only thing I don't like about Planet Zoo, but I know it is accurate. Accurately made. Right. Okay, I'm going to put a little... I kind of want the power thingy over here because I feel like it's a waste of area otherwise. Hmm. Yeah, do you guys, do you guys know what I mean? I just feel like if I put it there, it's like really wasted the area of how much power we can have. Um, but I do want to keep it tidy. Oh, what a conundrum. Okay, let's go through here. 
I'm gonna make a little place for some animal. I'm not gonna do anything else there because that won't be good. We'll get a little staff path and we'll put it like from here to there. Deselect grid. We'll just keep going along here. Boop. And then we'll just join that like that. It's really annoying that that is not in the middle, but that's okay. I can handle this. Um. Okay. So there's a little space for another animal, so that's nice. We could also get little habitat species in, and there's um, exhibit species in, and there's new ones. Oh, what's this thing? Oh, look at it. It's an axolotl. We have new ones, you see. So I would like to see some of those. A fire salamander. We've got a whatever this is, a dunob crested newt. Cool. We have... Do we have anything else? That's new? Probably. Um, oh, I just love the new stuff. New stuff makes me happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a red-eyed tree frog. That's new. That's great. It looks so weird looking as well. Cool. Cool. I know I have important... Oh, I know I need to put power there. Okay, well, what we'll do... I'm just going to put quite a lot of staff buildings and stuff in because... Fed up of them moaning at me all the time. Let's put another aligned grid. Let's just put, like... Put a big path bit there. That'll do. And then I'm going to put like a staff zone somewhere around here, I think. Um, don't quite know where or how, but I hope it fits. Um, so deselect grid because I don't really want to spend loads of money on. I don't want to select grid. Let's just get... don't know where that's going to fit. I mean, I could just put them down. I'm sure I can afford more. I'm not going to worry about it. We also need to check our water. Oh, that's tidy. Thank goodness. Let's just check that we've got clean water everywhere a second. Water. Doesn't look promising. Oh, right. You actually need to put like, clean water in. Okay. Cool. Okay. I don't want to put it on a group. Okay. I could put it there or I could put it over here, but then it's probably going to interfere with people. So we'll just put that around there. And then we'll put another one in. I think it hopefully will fit. I don't want to select red. Yeah, we'll just put one there, just for now. I don't know what animal we're going to have today. Is there any requests though, guys? Now I have all the expansion packs. Man, I spoil... My, I have spoiled myself. Man, I work hard. I can... I can... I can justify this. <laughs> so, um, let's start building an enclosure for something. Uh, why don't we use... What's this? Thick glass. Let's use concrete. <laughs> Might give you an idea of what I'm thinking. I have no idea. I'm not thinking anything, actually. I wish this would go. Okay. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> I wish you would leave. So we'll build just a big thick wall. Because then this will give us the option of having something really, really cool. This could be a park where I just put in all the new stuff that I've got off my expansion packs. But we will have a biome series, I promise, once I get my button gear. But it's going to be like speed builds and stuff like that, and that's why the editing's a bit trickier. So what I do at the moment is I just record these straight, and then just upload them. But, big but, um, I can't really do that with the biome ones in the sandbox, because I don't want you guys having to watch me build stuff like really slowly, do you know what I mean? Or maybe you guys want to see that, I don't know. Can curve. Oh, we can curve concrete. Oh, oh, this is an issue I do have with concrete. Oh, that was quite smart, actually. I'm happy with that. Okay, we need a little. Oh, I love the small gate. Um, let's put a proper habitat gate in there, just there. This is good. They've got a staff zone straight off of that. Right, let's go see what animals we can afford. I can afford loads of animals today, thank goodness. I do want something cool in there. <gasps> Look at the jaguar. I'm getting it. Oh, it's mine. Are these the same jaguar? I know this is a really stupid, stupid question. But the boys are black. Is that right then? The boys are black. And the females are... Spotted. Okay. Oh, I'm really happy with that. Okay, we just... We just bought some jaguars. Jaguars. 
Oh my goodness. Okay, let's just edit the barrier slightly. Oh my god. I am super excited about this. Yeah, I think Mars Zoo is definitely going to be like new, new species. Let's put in double-sided glass. Make sure I've actually got it the right way because you guys know what I'm like. Um, put in more double glass there. Cool. Um, and suddenly it's gone dark on us, which is really helpful. I'm hoping they're the same species of Jaguar. I'm not, I've not just made this up. I hope. Um... Okay, let's send to zoo. We have jaguars. This is very cool. We still have chimps that I bought from last time, like from the zoo before. This is ridiculous. I'm so excited. This is just crazy. <laughs> yes, tickets are severely underpriced. Now I have jaguars. Okay. Guest happiness rating is very high. We'll put some more uh, shops and stuff here because it does get clogged and people get really stoppy. I still have yet to put in transport systems. I'm scared. I'm not gonna lie. I am very, very scared. Because <laughs> Where's my Jaguar and why is it so dark? Hang on, let's change the zoo hours. Oh, I should have changed the zoo hours before. Maybe it went back. Why is it still dark? Hey, there we go don't want darkness. Okay, I think he's here. I think the first Jaguar's here. <gasps> Hello, you beautiful creature. That is beautiful. <laughs> oh my goodness. <gasps> I would like to get a screenshot of that, but my pilot zoo doesn't like taking screenshots, so I'll have to do that at the end. <gasps> Amazing. Okay, right, let's pause and sort him out. What do we need? We need water for a Jaguar. Cool. we can make a cool terrain here let's, let's have a little play so let's get a i do like this this reminds me of where did i go that has water with tigers the tigers have like a lakey thing okay i don't know if it's gonna work let's just put in do they have enough space okay they have enough space which is good let's just check that's enough water it's only they only need a little bit oh yeah loads and then they just need like a climbable area and we need to sort out the terrain. So um, let's put in... So they want soil. They like the long grass though, so that's good. Let's just put soil all around here. Make it a little bit more authentic. Like, soil is generally around water. We can have a little, like, pretend path. Yeah. This is cool. Okay, okay, okay. Do we need a hill? Probably not. Let's go to the... This is so cool. Let's put in some stuff. Let's put in rocks. Yeah, we love rocks. Again, this is another tropical animal, which has turned out quite well. So we could have sort of a tropical theme to open up the zoo with. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's use a tropical theme. I'm just going to put in a load of rocks. Oops. This is so fun. I'm so excited. I love new things because I've been wanting to buy the expansion packs for ages, but I just didn't I didn't want to have like spend the money on it yet. But do you know what? Something inside me broke today. I like the little rocks, it's cute. It's a bit in a giant rock. Not so giant now. Uh, okay, let's put in another cluster. I mean I'd like to make them maybe a little cave. Are they gonna climb up the cave? Possibly. I'll try and make a tiny circular cave thing, somehow. <laughs> this is not going to go well. Um, try. I will try my best to do this. Okay, well I've accidentally made that. Okay, need the big rock. This one. Okay, I just want to get rid of everything at the moment because everything is taking up so much room. So I'm just going to build them a teeny, teeny little cavey thing. And hope it they fit in it. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, let's just turn that one around. Oh. Okay, this is not a good idea. Let's just put that there and lift. I will try and make it look a bit more cave-like. Hopefully. Okay, I probably need the Z on that and turn that one around. Yeah, Planet Zoo. Man, Planet Zoo. I love it. It's like such a great game. I love Z, I do. Try and like 
I'm gonna try to put some layers in here so it looks less. Ah. Uh, what's the polite word? Rubbish. <laughs> I think that's the word. Does that look like a cave thing to you guys? I think it's quite nice actually. Um, I don't know if they're gonna want that as the like. Hello, Jaguar. Oh no, you're stuck in the rock. Okay. Let's just check the hard shelter works for them. Yes, it does. Thank goodness. And then let's put this for Jaguar. I have so many animals now. I've got to scroll so far to get to J. Yes. Very excited about this. I'd love a pet Jaguar. I don't know why I keep calling them Jaguars. It's not an English thing. Jaguar. Cool. They got a lovely little cave house thing. Right, let's put in some climbing stuff because quite frankly, I'm not building all that today. Because I don't... It's not for me. It's not my favourite part. Yeah, let's put these big bits of wood in there and some other things that look great. To be honest, they can probably go all up on these rocks and stuff as well then. As long as they don't jump out, because they're pretty good jumpers. So I might just edit this barrier at the back here so it's a teeny bit bigger. I have a feeling they might go out. <laughs> Ooh, the little monkeys. Okay, let's put in some stuff and hope, hope this works. Okay, so we have enrichment. There's no enrichment. I don't know if I've unlocked any, to be honest. Oh, look at this. We get new plants. Oh, that's made me excited. I love plants. We could put some plants all around here. Definitely around the rocks and stuff like that. We'll put in some bramble bushes. Let's just check they're happy with all this. Cool. Look at this. This is lovely. Yeah, we'll put in some tree stumps. Who doesn't like a good tree stump? They haven't got, like, I feel like they don't have loads of space. But, I don't know. I think they're okay. Fun. This is the most fun I've had on Planet Zoo for a while. I think it's because I finally have something where I'm like, ah, oh, it's new, you know? Put the different colours in. We're going to make it, definitely make it tropical themed, I think. Because there's grass and tropical. Oh, what have they got here? I don't need temperate. And I don't need. What other things do I not need? Oh, it does want temperate. Tropical. Doesn't need North America. Oh, it's got all of those in there. Okay. Strange. Wow, they can have lots and lots of plants then. This is cool. Let's put in some fig trees at the back here, maybe. We'll put some giant trees. I don't know what's climbable. <laughs> We've got to be a little bit careful with that. Put in a giant fig tree just there. Put in some more fig trees, because they're new. So that's good. Oh, a giant rhubarb. Cool. We get lots of rhubarb in England, actually. I love this. This is making me so happy. Okay, so we're going to fancy pants this all up. We'll put a little holly tree in there. And why not? All around the back here, we could add more trees too. Just hoping none of them are climbable. We'll see. I don't know what that is, but I like it. Look at this. New new plants. Planet Zoo, you spoil us. You spoil us. Um, over here, we're going to need space. That's all I'm saying. We are definitely going to need space for like their enrichment, things like that. So let's look at that now. So we do need a food tray. That's a large food tray. So we'll just put one in. They only need one to be fair. I'll put it there. Uh, water they've got, but we need to make sure it's clean. Underwater fish thing. Oh, cool. I don't think I made it kind of... I don't think I made it deep enough, but we can see if that works or not. And then... Do I have any enrichment stuff? I don't know. Toys, enrichment items. Here we go. So... We have quite a lot of climbable things, but let's let's see if we can put toys everywhere. And hopefully the, the keepers can actually reach the toys as well. That would be, be very helpful. Um, put a sprinkler in. Oh, it's a duck! It's a submarine duck! So actually the jaguar probably does need um, some deep water. What's this? Oh, I don't think it's quite worked, but the submarine's are really cool. That's cool. Uh, where can we put scratching posts? We might put it at the back here. Just get some other there. Like, there's not a lot of room because of the rocks. I thought I built quite a, I built quite a big enclosure. I don't know what I've done there. We'll put that one there. Though this one, this one looks better. That looks better to me. 
And then we'll put in another scratching tree. Should we put in more scratching trees? We'll put in a pinata. They love pinatas. We'll put in a prey thing. They have loads of stuff to do, which is great. That's what it should be about with a zoo. That is what it should be about. Definitely. Um, giving the animals the best, best life. Let's put a tree stump thing there. Uh, this back bit here is actually going to have all glass, I think. Yeah, we'll make it all have glass because then people could come around the back and view them. I mean, we could have glass all the way round, but I don't, do I? They do need their privacy too. I'm really happy with this enclosure and I cannot believe we have jaguars. This is crazy. Um, I've actually lost them now. Let's see the black one get introduced. Oh, wow. Jaguars. Look at him, guys. He's beautiful. What is the first? Oh, have I already used my torch? I've already used my torch. Wow. I'm so excited. We are going to go and get pictures of them in a bit, but... Let's just check they're happy. He's a gold one as well. <laughs> We're going to have gold babies. So the space isn't... They might need a bit more space. I, I was kind of thinking that what I might do then is I might delete this. I would like them to have a bit more space. They're going to have a mare, aren't they, when they think I'm letting the jaguars out. So we could just, if I just get my path system correct. <gasps> this is mad. Let's put in a little bit. Uh, yeah, and then we'll just expand it out a little bit here because then they've just got that little bit more space because if they have cubs they will be then struggling for the space oh no look at this <laughs> the wall looks tiny um how do i make this not so tiny where's height i want to be able to expand it outwards there but i never know how to do this okay this will have to just go there and hope that we can make it look half tidy <laughs> we'll see we will see but guys, if you're new to the channel, then welcome. Uh, this, is, uh, this is a dream of mine, playing Planet Zoo. I love it. Uh, so if you guys have any suggestions, any ideas that you want to see from the chat, then let me know in the comment section below. I'm all ears, as long as it is YouTube friendly. <laughs> and not rude. Okay, this is going to alter everything. So we can actually at least put more foliage in at the back here. And then we can actually do what I kind of wanted to do and make this glass so that's good but we do need more path because people gonna get clogged oh yeah let's put a little uh tree like a loggy tree one in that's nice it gets so busy i'm gonna put tree stumps all the way through there that's quite smart actually i'm happy with that now let's go check and see how that has now changed everything <laughs> that i that i'd sorted out oh it's okay actually we could put a little bit of rock in put rock around there Let's go, we need terrain, uh, we need painting. We don't need that, we need to just put some rock in around there. That's quite nice. Yeah, and actually we'll put more rocks in general just to kind of make it not look quite so, what's the word? Bland. It like just smudges in and that tree works really well. Just like put the tree in forever. There's no way of getting out now, buddy. I need these bigger rocks actually in Hidridge. Okay, cool. That doesn't look very good to me. I don't like it. Oh, let's put a big rock in. Oh, nice. Cool. Yeah, that looks okay. i tell you what we could put here, actually. If I go to my terrain tool. Uh, oh, I don't want any more water, actually, do I? Because unless I make one big, giant pit of, like, water, I don't know. Uh, Richmond. Okay, let's put in some more nature here. I think nature is a good idea. Okay, let's put in. Um, where's all the tropical stuff? Ah, okay. Let's put in a load of this. We could put some more bushy, like rocks and stuff. But we're definitely going to need more enrichment. I can just tell that we're going to need more enrichment. Hopefully, we can unlock enrichment as well. In fact, let's do that now. So we're going to go to. Vet research, we have a load of research to do. Oh my goodness. We have loads of research to do. <laughs> Whoops. Whoopsies. Okay, let's go back to nature. Yeah, we'll leave this space open at the back here. And we'll try and figure out um, if there's going to be 
much need for any enrichment space. Because actually, in a bundle there is quite nice. Okay, we definitely need all the boring stuff now, like the education stuff. I like the fact we've accidentally made, though, a tropical, a tropical thing. Uh, that's a poor station, which we actually already have with the lemurs, but I'll leave one in there. Also, a sound thing. These are new. These are so new to the channel. These, are, well, to the to the game. I think it's wicked. No, something's about to inbreed. No, no, no. Bad monkeys. I know you're still not monkeys. Why? Why are you inbreeding? Did I accidentally buy two two from the same place? Or has somebody aged up and I don't know? Because if you're doing that, guys, you're gonna have to leave. You're going to have to leave. Um, so which which one is in, trying to inbreed? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to get rid of the male. I'll probably buy a new male then. Oh yeah, let's release you to the wild, buddy. Oh. Okay, and then... Oh my goodness, look at all these babies! This is ridiculous. We've had four black and white ruffled lemur babies already. Whoops. Whoops, Liz. Okay, let's go get a male... Uh, a male red fluffer. Surprised the ringtail haven't bred yet, actually. Okay, the zoo. Do you think the zoo is going to get particularly stressful? I think it might, because I think it's going to be quite a big zoo. Red panel, red ruffled lemur. Okay, here we go. I need a male. A good male. That's not... That's got good stats. Would be good. Uh, let's go appeal upwards. Ooh, these aren't very good for the money. I mean, you might be okay. I would like that fertility to be up. Okay, well, let's just buy him. Adopt. And then let's put you... Where did he go? Where did he go? Yeah, and, and luckily I've got quite a big, powerful computer. So hopefully it's going to be able to, like... It's going to be... Did I buy a female? I'm so confused. I might have accidentally just bought a female. I am so confused. Okay, I actually bought a female. We still need to buy a male then. I'm being so dopey today. Just want a male. Yeah, you'll do. Now it's definitely a male. Pretty sure it's a male. <laughs> this is crazy. I need to go put donation boxes out by my Jaguars because I'm missing out on quite a lot of money right now. Quick! Where's donation boxes? Your donation boxes. Wow. Man. This zoo is clogged. It's going to get very clogged. Oof, they love the jaguars as well. We could turn this bit all into glass. I have quite a bit of space here. But I'm definitely going to put in some shops and things like that so people have, have food. Probably need another educator as well. It's Link Seeding! Yeah, it's nice that Planet Zoo are actually... Oh, I've confirmed that. And then we need a species, which is Joe you are. Yeah, we need... Oh, look at them both in the water. That's really sweet. Man, people love these. So let's put out some more boards and stuff like that. And the speakers. Okay. Conservation board. Conservation board. And another one there. Would be good. We do need a big old speaker as well. I might open up the back because I think these jaguars are going to be massively... Um, I think they're going to be very popular. That's all. Okay, let's put... Oh, sorry, microphone. Let's put that there and that there. And then we can expand it outwards. And people are going to have a great time here. Okay, cool. They're getting edu very much educated there. And Jaguar here. So sort of covering that bit. That's great. I think I'm happy with that. Though, that might... That might clash. Oh, that's the wrong one. Let's just go on here a second. Let's just knock that down a little bit. Um, and let's move it over slightly. Oh, like, maybe there? I mean, I could put it on this rock here. That's a good idea. But I need to hide it if I'm going to do that. Oh, no. Probably not the best idea I've ever had. Mm. Oh gosh, people really need the toilet. Hang on, guys. I've just seen somebody and they really need the loo. Bear with me. Oh, let's, let's go. Guest facilities. Let's... We could put a modern one in. Yeah, let's put a massive modern one in. Clearly struggling. 
Yeah, I wanted to put shops all along here anyway, so that's good. Oh, did I do that correct? Did that, did that work? Oh, there's one there as well. Let's just put a path around here. Ooh. Okay, fine. Toilets, great. Hopefully people will then go to the... <laughs> Look at this bloke! He obviously really needs a wee. <laughs> or a poop. Okay, let's have a look here. So I still need to, I still, I, I feel like I'm faffing today. I'm really excited about this series though. Why is it taking me so long to get back on Planet Zoo? I don't know. But we have loads of like animal games on here. It's the whole point in this channel is all the animal games. I love animals, as you can tell. Uh, let's put in education again. Education. And I just, yeah, I just love animals. And I'm hoping that you guys do too and then together we will be able to find some really cool animal games but I don't think it's oh, I think it's been very difficult for anything to beat Planet Zoo um I think it's been very difficult for anything to beat Planet Zoo I really do that's worked really well on that rock actually I think that's fine but why do I not have a speaker here it's because I can afford one I think and we're putting ringtail doodars here aren't we let's just move this slightly so it's there then we could probably up this one slightly. Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's good. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're enjoying their little animal talk as well. So I'm finished. I keep faffing around here. So we need this for Jag. Jug, jug, jug. I like that they have a lot of space now. That was annoying me before. Don't like animals to not have any space. I like them to have more space than possibly necessary. Oh, do I need... What's going on here? What is going on here? Oh, it needs a Jaguar on it. That's what's going on. Okay. We'll put Jaguar here as well. Then what should we do in the next episode, guys? What animals do you guys want to see? Now I have most of the animals. Yes. I have so many animals. I am super excited. Let's put the raw thing there because that's fun. And what else do we need? What else do we need? We could put a big conservation like thing all along here, like a big one. Yes! Like that, you can see where it's kind of wonky, <laughs> which is annoying me. So I'll put in, let's put in about like deforestation because that's really important with the rainforest. I'm really scared about the future guys, I'm not gonna lie. Um, you know, the whole global warming thing, it's, it's absolutely terrifying to me. Um, I mean, I'm all up for going back to riding horses everywhere. I know we wouldn't get very far, but I think life would be simpler. I think people would be happier. You know? <laughs> That's my opinion. Okay, I think... Do we have everything? Have I missed something? I feel like I've missed something. Ah, I need those boards in back here. Okay, that's what I have missed. Okay. Put in a board here as well. I'm going to put in a board. Oh, we'll put in a board here. That's fine. And we'll put in a board there. And we'll just see if any of the research has been done. I mean, I doubt it. And I think that's it. I think we've done everything for the Jaguars today. I'm so excited about this. This is amazing. So, yeah, let's stick with kind of a... We could stick this side with a sort of tropical theme. And we are going to do our bio themes once this zoo's done, I think. Just need to see how this channel goes. I'd like to grow this channel as much as I can. If you could help me get to 2,000 subscribers, that would be... That would be amazing, guys. So if you are new and you're thinking about subscribing, or maybe just forget, don't forget, please do subscribe. It's very, very exciting, this channel. But loads of cool games. Loads of random games, app games, all sorts. Do you know what? I do not have an information centre anywhere. So we probably need to put one of those in, because they are crucial for education. So we'll put in... We'll put in two, ed uh, two information centres here. So people have stuff to do i would also like to just get some nature i <laughs> loves nature and i would like to fancy pants up some of this so it just feels a bit more like just feels a bit better for people like tropical i'd like maybe to make some tropical like themed entrances here don't know what yet but i i might do that next episode so I'll make something fancy in these two as a welcoming yeah. and now i have money to do these things 
So I'm super excited about that. But what animal shall we have next, guys? Just pop down in the comment section below what you'd like to see. Any other ideas that you have for the channel? I know some of you guys have mentioned like wolf quests and things like that. It's in my head. I promise we will get to do it. This channel is a little bit slow. Oh my goodness, look at the rubbish. <gasps> I am a bit sad. I'm going to try and post twice a week on here if I can. And yeah, so if you guys could be there to support me, that would be wonderful. But this channel, I'm just very excited to play Planet Zoo. I don't. I don't actually mind who watches just as long as you're here enjoying it. Just enjoy it. That's all I want. Just enjoy life, really. I'm going to type in bench because I can't find it. Okay. Let's get a new world bench. Oh, it doesn't fit. That's annoying. Put a big bench there. Okay. There's bins. Oh, bins, man. It's going to be one of those again. I was like, no, no more bins. I'm like, no. Don't really want to put bins in all day. Every day. Oh no, it's all confused. Planet Zoo is confused. Okay, I've got four bins there. Okay, let's put in let's put in a bin or two here. Yeah, I'm super excited about that. That's great. A Jaguars, we have so many animals though that I cannot wait to show you. And we're gonna be exploring all of those in this series of the Mars Zoo. So it's again, it's a it's one it's a branch of the franchise called Sunnyside. It's our yeah. I've actually stuck with it and we've actually completed a couple of zoos and that's thanks to you guys. So thank you so much for watching. And as I say, please help us get to 2000 subscribers. It will be amazing. And the best thing that you can do to help the channel is smashing that like button. I'd really appreciate that. Please do smash the like button for us. Yeah. Have a wild rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.